Thank you all for staying long enough to join us as we take you through a few moments of the Smart from the Start story. So what is Smart from the Start? Smart from the Start is a program that was born out of Mayor Menino's desire to do something about the achievement gap that had for generations been plaguing the most vulnerable children of our city. We work exclusively with families that are considered to be the lowest 10% income families in the city. We work in five communities now. We will be expanding to two additional communities in the next couple of months. And we currently have served, uh, are serving 600 children, about 400 families. And since we serve every member of the family, we are currently serving about 14 to 1,500 people. Smart from the Start believes that if we're going to serve a child well, and we are going to really make a change in the way that children are able to prepare for school success. We have to employ more of an ecological approach to this work. You can't serve a young child in a family that's not healthy and thriving and expect things to change. And you can't change a family in a community that's not thriving and healthy. So Smart from the Start employs this model so that we're working on all three levels uh, at the same time to promote change. Smart from the Start works with families whose average annual income is $8,000 in a city where the median income is $60,000. What we know is that the evidence tells us that early intervention is key. Most of the children in the city of Boston by third grade are not reading at the, at, the, at a level of proficiency. About 30% of Boston's children achieve a score of proficiency on their third grade reading test. And what we know is that by 12th grade, many of our children don't graduate due to uh, an achievement gap that existed in first grade. The other thing the research tells us is that if we invest early with children, then children are less likely to be involved in the juvenile justice system, to need additional social services or special education or remedial education. If we invest early, children are more likely to graduate from high school, to go to post-secondary uh, education, and to obtain a level of employment that they will be able to sustain their families at. We employ a really unique outreach model. So we go to our families instead of sitting in our centers and expecting our families to come to us. We meet families where they're at. So our outreach model is very unique. The way we build relationships with families is unique as well. What we know is that families have been failed in some way by the system. The onus is on the system to serve the family. And what we also know is that many of us that were trained in social services have, have been trained to address families from a deficit-based approach, kind of like a medical model. What's wrong with the family and how can we fix it so we can move on to the next family? Instead, what we know is that relationships that are built by recognizing strengths are relationships that have a foundation of mutual respect and trust. And those relationships are the kinds of relationships that you can really build on and do, and do some really meaningful work in the context of those relationships. So what we do is meet families, identify their strengths, and introduce them to their strengths for the first time. And this inspires families to set and achieve goals that they never thought were imaginable. Our programming is unique because we know that every neighborhood in the city of Boston is unique. And so we customize our programming in each neighborhood with the help of our families and our partners so that, the, so that we are being uh, good stewards of our resources and we're taking advantage of existing resources and communities. And what the data tells us is that what we're doing is working. Smart from the Start kids are right online developmentally with their suburban counterparts, which is amazing. We're only three and a half years old. So our two-year goals include going deeper and broader in the city. We want to reach more families in the communities where Smart from the Start lives now. And we also want to expand to additional communities with eventually reaching every at-risk community in the city of Boston. In order to do this, we need to raise about six to $800,000 over the next couple of years. There are a number of ways that you can help us out on our journey. 
One, of course, is to help us to raise funds. But in addition to that, we are trying to, uh, we're trying to build our executive board. So we're looking for board members for Smart from the Start. If we keep doing what we've always done, we're going to continue to get what we've always gotten. What we do is innovative, and it's progressive, and it works. Please support Smart from the Start. Thank you.